Welcome to Education Lifeline. Today, we will be solving word problems on compound inequalities. Now, if you haven't watched our previous videos on compound inequalities, they will be linked in the description below, as well as in the top right hand corner of your screen. Please check those videos out before watching this one. So here the word problem says, a kid's size four soccer ball cannot weigh less than 11 ounces or more than 13 ounces. You add two ounces of air to a deflated ball to fulfill the requirement. How much could the ball have weighed before adding additional air? So what we need to do to solve this word problem is to create a compound inequality from the word problem. So we know that the ball cannot weigh less than 11 ounces or more than 13 ounces, which means that the ball has to weigh between 11 and 13 ounces. So if we use the variable b, we can write the equality 11 is less than b, which is less than 13. But the catch is, is that the ball cannot weigh less than 11 ounces or more than 13 ounces. But it can weigh exactly 11 or 13 ounces. So we need to write less than or equal to. Now the second part information we're given is that you add two ounces of air to the ball, so B plus two. And after adding the two ounces of air to the deflated ball, you fulfill the requirement where the ball is between 11 and 13 ounces inclusive. And inclusive means that it includes 11 and 13. So after adding the two, ounces of air, the ball was between 11 or 13 ounces inclusive. And this is the inequality that we want to solve. This inequality right here was just a start. So we can subtract all the sides by two, and that gets us 11 minus two or nine, which is less than or equal to b, which is less than or equal to 13 minus 2, or 11. And this right here will be our final answer. The ball had to weigh between 9 and 11 ounces before you added the additional air to fulfill this requirement here. If this video was helpful, please drop a like and subscribe to Education Lifeline. Be sure to watch your previous videos and check the description below for other helpful resources. Thanks for watching.